Well, hello, hello, everyone, and welcome to another hardcore Minecraft episode in 1.20. My name is CNC, and perhaps you're wondering how did I got here. Well, let's go outside. Oh, that's not how I got outside. Ah, that's that's how you go outside. And what do we have here? Oh my goodness! I have made a shulker farm. That's right. It took me three days. Well. I guess not really three days. It, it took me one whole day to build that thing, but we have also done other stuff the other day. And today we are doing other stuff as well. It's very, very interesting. I gotta say, a lot of hard work. Well, I'm so happy that the shulk farm works. It's a little bit loud, I would say. Should probably turn the volume down, but let me show you how it works. Basically, there is some iron golems. Oh wait, no, it's not iron golems. It's pumpkins, guys. It's snow golems. There's snow golems over there, and they are shooting um, snowballs at the shulkers. And the shulkers are randomly teleporting and duplicating all over this thing. And they are going all the way up there. And let me go up the scaffolding and show you the magic that's happening over here. And this farm, it's very, very productive. And perhaps you're wondering why do I need so many shulker shells, shulker boxes and everything. Well, we're going to need lots of shulker boxes for my automatic storage system, which has been redesigned and rebranded. All right. How oh, can you see in the background? There is two mine cars that are exporting the shulkers and placing them to one spot and they are dying because of mob entity cramming or some too many entities require you know some space and if there's too many they they are gonna cause damage to each other and they die instantly so they die and the shulker shells are being collected by some hoppers into a double chest and this is a design from YouTube I found. I don't remember who made that design, so I don't know who to credit. But thank you for making this on YouTube. And uh, yeah, I did not make this farm. I got it. Uh, I got a tutorial on YouTube. It's very simple. How can you see? But it took me a whole day yesterday to make this whole thing. But luckily, we did do it, and it's functional. Now let's fly all the way there and get all the shulkers and go back to the overworld. And perhaps you're wondering, wait, how do you do all of this? Well, in the background, you can see there is lots of redstone and stuff because it took me a while. The hardest part of building the shulker farm was when I had to transport the shulker from the end city to the farm. Okay, can you see there is there is a shulker farm. There is a, there's, there's an end city over here, and we have transported the shulker from. It, one was oh it's still there oh it saw me <laughs> don't shoot and we got the shulker over here and the shulker got teleported into the farm and the farm works now let's go and collect all of the shulker shells that we can let me just uh empty my inventory we have so many junk items we do not need well i guess i might need that one that one is probably the most important one and Let's go all the way up there. And get all the shulkers. There is so many, I don't even need that many. This farm is absolutely super necessary if you want to make your hardcore world last forever. Otherwise, you'll have to make crazy, very laggy sorting systems. But with this, you can make my story system, which is super compact and not laggy almost at all it's very very nice now that is a lot of shulker shells and <laughs> how many shulker boxes is that probably a lot more than i'll ever need so we'll probably not come here in a very very long time because we have so many shulker shells now let's go back home so i have made a small path that goes all the way home so this way oh i also need to destroy and i need an ender pearl so I should probably put this into my ender chest. Okay, I do have an ender chest over this way. Where is it? I have an ender chest over here. I'm going to put one stack over there because I'm going to need 
going to need some uh, and the pearls. Hello. Come, come, come. I'm gonna need some ender pearls. There's. Where are you going? So loud. Calm down. Just need your balls. I mean, pearls. Thank you, sirs. Well, now. Where is it? Aha, uh -huh, there you go. So I made a path that goes all the way to this end gate that goes me to the main island. And we needed an ender pearl because I don't have a trap door. So, boop. There we go. We made it all the way to here. Now, all we gotta do is to get out of here. Oh, <laughs> what is this place? Oh, come on. Not helping. All right, let's fly all the way. Oh, I thought the fountain wasn't working. I was like, what? It was not rendered. All right, let's go. Oh my goodness, all the way home. Beautiful, beautiful, sweet home. And we have so many shulker shells. Now let's go all right, let's go home. My story system and place all of these shulker shells where they belong. Oh yeah, we have also got some junk, which is disappearing. Wow, amazing. Oh yeah, there's so much stuff I had to place in here. So I'm gonna put most of these in there because we're not gonna need all of them right now. Looks like this is almost full. Okay, I guess one stack is good enough. I'm gonna put that in there and it should just toss this away. I don't need it right now. So, all right. Pretty convenient, I would say. Now let's go and craft some shulker boxes, boys. We're gonna need some of that and some of this. Oh, that is so many shulker boxes. Perhaps you're wondering why do I need so many shulker boxes? Well, this is one of the reasons why I need shulker boxes. There is so many things you can, I mean, I'm gonna put these in there for now, and huh, I guess we should do some quickly sorting things and we should craft some more barrels. Oh yeah, I, I should go and show you where do we craft those barrels. So we go all the way to this farm, which is my bamboo farm. Luckily, we have so much bamboo. Basically, we do this, convert all of this bamboo into bamboo blocks. And then bamboo planks, just like so. And then we transform them into slabs, and then we transform them into barrels. Because, did you know that barrels are 10 billion times better than, than chests? Barrels do not lag your world. Barrels are not entities, they are full blocks, and they are not laggy. Unfortunately, you cannot combine barrels into a big barrel. Perhaps Minecraft developers will make it into a big barrel, but... Until then, it's fine. So, yeah, definitely 10 times better than uh, a chest, which is extremely lacking. Now, let's convert all of this and replace the chest I have in my story system with barrels and fill all of the shulkers that we need with the materials so we make space for more items into my story system. Let's go. It's going to take a while, so we'll be back. All right, so I wanted to show you how much cobblestone we've got from one single orange part so over here we do have cobblestone and we got all of these shulker boxes full with cobblestone and we are making so much progress so we can fill all of this in with shulkers and all of the shulkers have so much cobblestone inside <laughs> that's a lot and that's very compact and we do not need to make much more you know hoppers and redstone because we can have only four and all of those four could be filled with shulker boxes and cobblestone which is quite a lot of cobblestone but we have not one of this but two we have one more over the back so let me just go all the way there by the way we should probably get more shulker boxes i guess i could get all of these shulker boxes with me and uh, my rockets as well and go to the other cobblestone thing, which is probably full as well with cobblestone. 
Yeah, that's right. We have so much cobblestone in this world, and <laughs> I guess we have two dedicated special cobblestone storage sorting solution part. Okay, um, this was a quick break to show you how and what I'm doing. All right. All right, so we have removed all of the old chests and everything is now barrels. Well, except this chest over here, <laughs> I guess. And uh, how can you see? We have got lots and lots of shulker boxes and we have a shulker farm now. And we are not going to be worried about having enough storage in this because we will definitely have... Shulker boxes are so useful to compact and make your story system much better. But there is some stuff I need to do. Let's go down. Well, here. <laughs> oh goodness, I can't believe I pulled that off. So we need to put this floor over here because we'll need to put barrels over here as well because the whole line in my back is has been uh, filled and this is getting filled as well. So we should do this right now and I do have some more deep slate in here but I guess I do have some deep slate in my storage room but I guess I could always go and mine some more deep slate. Let's see, where is the mine? I think I have a mine of deep slate thingies over here. Should have brought more... Should have brought more torches and rockets. Okay, so this is the mine we had built before. And we do have some more deep slate in here, so I guess I could use that for now. So let's get all of this and go all the way back up. Luckily, we do have some of those rockets, and now we should transform them into deep slate tiles and deep slate tile stairs, and we shall fill the whole floor in, and then we should put the barrels, and we are set. Well, it looks so good. All right, let's... All right, so we have successfully placed all of the tiles down and the stairs and the barrels. And we are ready to store more items. Okay, stop making noises. Stop. What are you doing? All right, so we have also started to make the sniffer farm. Let me just go up and show you. But first, we're gonna need some leather. No, leads. So, we're gonna need some string. Which we do have string somewhere around here. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. And we're gonna need some slime balls. Hopefully, we do have some slime balls. I do have slime over here. Ah, yes. Hopefully, that's enough slime. Nine. That's probably good enough. And... Oh, it's currently raining. Ah, sweet. Can we sleep? No. So we start to make the raid... No, raid. It's not the raid farm. The sniffer farm. Very simple. Just some hopper minecart underneath. And the grass. And we're gonna place the sniffer, the sniffer over here. But... <coughs> But we have to craft the leads. Oh, 18 leads. That's probably going to be good enough. Now, let's go and grab the sniffers from all around this place. Which, I think there is a few over here. Um, Hello? Where did the sniffers go? I guess most of the sniffers went towards here. I kind of lost the sniffers. <laughs> Come with me, sniffer. And you too, sniffer number two. Come with me. Time to go. The farm. Okay, we have so many sniffers over here. Oh my goodness. Look at all of them. 
super big gigantic sniffers oh my gosh all right do we okay can you please go this way sir i would very much appreciate that all right now they are all trapped in here and we do have some more eggs so let's get the eggs that we have and put them on the moss blocks and we should have more sniffers in there. More sniffers. But first we need to get some moss. And the moss, it's over here. Moss blocks, where are you? Let's go. 24 should be good enough. I think I have four eggs anyway. Okay, uh, right. the eggs are in these barrels over there. That should be good enough, I think. Pretty cool. Let's go. Ow, yo. Alright, let's put these. Oh, they're already working. One, two, three, four. All right. Nice. Hopefully we get more torch flowers because we're going to breed them so we can get more eggs. Ah, we do. We got some torch flowers. Nice. We can get more eggs now. Brilliant. All right. Oh, we still need one more. I thought we have double jump over here. All right, who wants to be bred? There we go. Make babies. And that's how babies are born. <laughs> Sniffer babies, I mean. Kind of cute. And this is my Sniffer's farm. So basically, all we gotta do is, you know, have some walls and some grass. And the egg over there, oh, is being picked up by this thing below me. It's a minecart with hopper. It's picking up all of the items from above and placing them into this chest over here. There we go, got a sniffer egg. Nice, another sniffer egg to my collection. And we should plant a sniffer egg on this. Because we want as many sniffers as, I, as we can. I mean, uh, not that many because it's gonna get laggy. But still, that is probably enough sniffers for now. Hopefully they will produce lots of cool flowers because I love the new Minecraft flowers. Minecraft ancient flowers. Uh, I guess I could actually decorate here with some of those beautiful flowers. Hmm. I should probably... Well, I should have got more moss. Alright, let's put that honeycomb blocks where they belong and that is over here. We are going to store all of the honeycomb blocks and we should bring more shulkers in here. And we should fix the floor because the floor got broken. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. That's what happens when you are rushing to go towards somewhere. Now, let's get some more blocks. M more moss blocks. Ouch. I don't know if 19 is enough. So we're gonna get like two more stacks or something because we want to put some flowers over there because they are very gorgeous gonna harvest all of them from here which you can do with a silk touch hoe or i think you could also do it with like i don't know something else such as Shears, maybe? Oh, there's a sniffer over there? How'd I miss that? Okay, that's fine. I'm not gonna go and get that guy. Have your fun, Mr. Sniffer. Well, we should probably go sleep. Because we don't want to spawn monsters, so monsters are exploding the sniffers. That would be terrible. Okay. Let's get all the flowers. There's still more over here. And we should plant... those flowers on that thing up there and we should put the moss blocks on top oh the eggs are starting to hatch let's go 
I don't have that many flowers, so... Can you feed these guys flowers? Just curious. No, I guess you cannot. Alright. So, I guess I'm gonna put those two over here. And the rest, like so. They are so beautiful. I really love those new flowers. Pretty good. <laughs> That looks so cute already. Did we get more flowers and stuff? Let's see. We got one more. Nice. I mean, I could get one more sniffer guy. Probably. Or maybe not. Let's just plant those flowers into the ground. Right. That would be the, the wise way. Can you plant those things? Oh, I guess you need to plant them. Oh, did the, did the sniffer hatch? I mean, I guess I cannot see it that well. Then I, <laughs> I wonder if mine, the minecart is doing a good job at placing things in here because I did not make an automatic stopper for the minecart. So let's check if it has anything inside of there. It has. It doesn't have anything. So that means it's working. I mean, this farm is not producing that many blocks. So yeah, pretty much. It, we don't need to worry. So let's put those things over here and hopefully they will grow. I mean, they should be growing. <laughs> All right. And we are out of rockets. Again. But hopefully the sniffer farm will become much better. In the future. Oh my gosh, I don't have any more rockets. That's ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, that's probably going to be good enough sniffers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I guess 11 sniffers is probably good enough. They will produce the flower things. And we are going this way because I am out of rockets. Hello, Mr. Villagers. How are you doing today, Mr. Villagers? Oh, I do have more flowers over here. I forgot about these guys. Oh, huh. kind of cool. Hello there, Mr. Villager. How are you doing? I gotta say, the flowers from the sniffers are very, very gorgeous and beautiful. But I am so proud and happy that we have made a shulker farm and improved my story system by far a lot. Let's put those things in here and get some uh, rockets. I'm always running out of rockets. It's kind of my thing to run out of rockets every single day. Okay, all right. The story system is so much less laggy. The FPS in here, it's very smooth, which I'm so, so happy. There is literally zero chests. It's just this. So basically, if we are going very far away, we have the render distance for the entity on low. But how can you see? You can see all of the barrels because barrels are full blocks and they are not lagging my story system which it's amazing and I'm so happy that this thing exists because chests are extremely laggy. So now with these barrels, things are much, much, much better, even though the barrels have half the capacity of double chests, but that's okay because we've got this. That's right, we got unlimited shulker boxes because we have a very awesome shulker farm. Thank you so much for watching and see you all into the next episode. Bye bye everyone. Have a nice, beautiful, amazing day.